Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Yes, I am in my bathroom today because I'm going to be doing uh, my, what you call this, nighttime skincare routine. Uh, there are lots of subscribers, my viewers, my friends who has been requesting me to do a skincare video for really long. So here I am with my updated skincare routine. I have done one, I don't know, a few years back. It's the old uh, video. So yeah, I'm going to be doing it now. So I, I have got my scarf on at the moment just to get the hair out of my face and I have got this full face makeup. Even I have got this kiss proof, <laughs> waterproof uh, lipstick and I'm just going to show you how I remove all my makeup. So let's get started. Firstly, I get rid of my eye makeup. So recently I have been using this um, Clinique Take the Day Off Makeup Remover for leads and lashes, that one there. What I do is I shake this up and take a cotton pad. And then just put that on my eyes for a couple of minutes, not a couple of minutes, a few seconds really. Just press that down gently so that I could get rid of all the eye makeup that I have got on. Just like so, as you can see. I'm just going to turn the same cotton pad and again, use it to get rid of all the eye makeup remover. As you can tell, all my eye makeup has been removed just by one cotton pad. So again, I'm going to be taking another cotton pad and use that in the other side of my eyes. And just get rid of all the eye makeup. And then what I do is I take a makeup wipe. I just grab any random makeup wipes because I'm not very fussy about um, any brand for makeup wipes. So at the moment I've been I have been using this micellar water, micellar water wipe, which I got from um, Savers for a pound. So it, it's really nice, it gets rid of everything on your face. So I'm just going to get rid of all the makeup that I have got. After that's done, I'm going to take the same wipe and take the clean side and wipe the lipstick off. Uh, this I don't know this wipe get this wipe get rid of all the uh, lipstick. Other if if the wipe doesn't do the job, then I do use the Clinique um, the makeup remover uh, or to get rid of the lipstick as well. So yeah. So yeah. After that, I have a. Uh, wiped my face off with um, my, what you call this, uh, wipe. What I do is I take another cotton pad and then use my micellar water. I do use my Garnier micellar water, but recently I have just bought this Soap and Glory uh, micellar water, which I have been enjoying uh, using it. it. I don't know, it's different from all the micellar water. It has got some, I mean, it just, makes the skin feel really really clean i don't know how it does it and also uh other other micellar water uh, d does its jobs obviously it cleans everything uh from your face and then when it dries um it kinds of 
leave your skin dry but this one here it has got something on it that it just feels like you have got some sort of serum on your face when you use this one so yeah i just use this this water to just get rid of rest of the makeup it doesn't even stink my eyes you can use it to remove your eye makeup as well so yeah that's what i do so I have got, there you go, if you can see, even after using that wipe, I have got lots of makeup left in there. It just get, gets into the pore and get all that makeup out. So yeah, after that, what I do is I use my cleansing oil to cleanse, deep clean my face. So um, I have been using lots of oil. Uh, I love my... Oh, this one uh, is from the body shop as you can tell I'm almost out of it um, my Garnier oil I also use this um, the body shop chamomile um, what do you call this the cleansing butter I also use um, this one here from Emma Hardy just bear the packaging my top lid had just broken and I have I'm left with this, I don't know, there was like transparent lid on top of that, but it fell off and it broke. So I also use this Emma Hardy uh, Moringa Face Balm. This is how it looks like. Again, I'm almost out of that. Or I also sometimes, I mean, I recently bought this one, Super Fair Facialist by Una Brennan uh, Oil. So I have got uh, different types of oil and cleansing butter. I mean, what do you call this one? Yeah, cleansing balm. So for today, what I am going to be using is, I'm going to be using my Body Shop cleansing oil. And I'm just going to put this all over my face. Uh, even around my eyes around my forehead, just everywhere, and just massage it. This will, this oil helps to get rid of all the remaining makeup that's left in your face. It breaks down every, everything. Uh, if you have got the waterproof mascara on your face, it uh, even get rid of that one. Um, so yeah, what I do is I literally just massage it all over for a few seconds so I have got this steamy warm flannel in my hand so what I'm going to be doing is I'm just going to be putting this all over my face and just uh, use it in a circular motion. It also helps to exfoliate your face and also get rid of all the dirt makeup that's left in your face throughout the day. <laughs> right. So yeah, after that cleansing oil is all uh, taken off, what I do is I double cleanse actually because I had whole lot of makeup throughout the day in the evening I like to cleanse my face twice so for the second time what I like to use is I do use like a hot cloth cleanser or I use some sort of a like exfoliating um, not exfoliating but uh, a cleanser that has got glycol or some sort of exfoliating uh, you know not the beads but chemical exfoliant on it so right, for this purpose i do again i have got a whole lot of cleanser i am a skincare junkie so i have got a whole lot of different types of cleanser but the most used one is this one here it's clinic liquids facial soap uh, it's an extra mild it has got that glycolic acid on it which is amazing i also use this peach and clean as you guys know if you've been watching this one is the older packaging here and um if you could see I'm all gone I mean I have almost I mean it's all gone actually and so yeah I normally use peach and clean all-time favorite I also use 
um, leaves oral cleanse and polish so it just depends on what my skin really is asking first so today I'm and also I have got this one here from soap and glory again hot cloth you know the oops the ultimate hot cloth cleanser I have used this in prep past so yeah so for today I'm going to be using my clinic uh, clinic one I just used a generous amount of this one all over my face I just don't use it around my eyes because if this thing gets into your eyes it so yeah I just use it all over my face except the eyes and again massage it all over my face um, for a few, a few minutes to the uh, after you finish massaging your face again I just use the hot flannel again warm flat flannel not hot but I just try to use as warm as hot as possible so yeah I just use that flannel so yeah I just take this flannel and then just get rid of all those cleanser again in a like you know circular motion so yeah after the um, cleanse after you have taken the cleanser off you can definitely uh, go with another scrub uh, or um, you can also put a face mask on I have just done that recently but uh, for exfoliation what I use is I do use Sanctu uh, Sanctuary Spa warming microderm abrasion pot polish which is really really uh, exfoliating cleanses your pores really nicely and for the mask I do use my Lush mask of Magnum NT. I have got one from Michael Todd the pumpkin one I have got like uh, from again the warming uh, what you call it from warming face masks same from this uh, Sanctuary Spa brand I have got a face mask from um, body shop and I've got yeah lots of face masks which I normally use but today I'm not going to be doing any exfoliating because I have been using lots of exfoliating things as well as this uh, thing did it, its job so what I'm going to be doing now is just tone my face so yeah for the toner I do use my pixie glow tonic uh, yeah pixie glow tonic as you can tell, I'm almost out of it. I have got lots of skincare which I'm almost out of. So yeah. So that's the toner that I use all over my face. Again, it has got that glycolic acid and yeah, lots in it. So yeah, I don't use that around my eyes. Because again, if it gets into the eyes, it burns. It really does burns. So yeah, let's take that to my neck as well. So yeah, after that, uh, I also put a zero zinc uh, from La Roche-Posay, which unfortunately I haven't got that here. So I just go mm, to my eyes. So I have been using this Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Eye Serum. So what I do is I take two pump of that. One pump for each eye and just put it around the eyes and just spread that all over. And when after the serum is applied, what I do is I do take this um, Origins Transcription Anti Aging Eye Cream. I've been using anti aging because I'm in my late 20s, so I think I should be using an anti aging cream before it's too late. So, yeah, I just take that one and just put it underneath my both of the eyes and just massage it all over don't be very harsh with your eye area because they are these areas are really really delicate so yeah i just 
leave it like that. And then what I do is I take my clinic uh, turnaround revitalizing treatment oil. As you can tell, I have used quite a lot. I have just bought this a few weeks ago. And yes, I'm just loving this. I just literally take a few drops of that. I rub it in my hand and just put it all over my face. It just feels so nice. Uh, it doesn't feel like an oil at all. It just sinks into your skin. It's just amazing. When you wake up in the morning, your skin feels glowing. I mean, this skincare, which I have been using recently, has changed my skin. Everybody is uh, saying that I have got a very, very glowing skin at the moment. I don't know if it's because of the pregnancy or because of the product I'm using, but yeah, I've been loving this product. So yeah, what I, after the oil is all synced into the skin, what I use is I use a serum. And for the serum, I have been using Estee Lauder Advanced Night Reaper Serum. Again, I take a few drops of that. And then just apply all over my face. And I just bring that down to my neck. I know some of you might be, uh, some of you might be thinking, oh my gosh, she put lots of product on her face. But yeah, this is basically what I do every single day um, in the evening uh, because it really does work. I mean, you know, you're not putting any makeup on in the evening and then your skin is resting in the night. Uh, nobody's, I mean, you don't have to worry about your makeup meltdown or you don't have to worry about you being greasy. So I just put, I just layer lots of product really and it does work. So yeah. And the last step I do is I put my night cream and I've been using the Shiseido, the skincare night moisture recharge. This cream is amazing. I had the day cream as well, but um, it's gone. It's all gone. So this one is almost gone as well, as you could tell. So yeah, I just put that cream just all over my face. And any leftover, I just get that to my neck. I just bring it down to the neck. And just apply it all over and yeah that's what I do I just uh, do all that and sometimes uh, when I am feeling a bit lazy what I do is uh, after I cleanse and do everything I do apply my uh, alpha, alpha H liquid gold all over my face and just leave it um, to do its job without applying any cream or anything on the days when I feel really lazy or yeah this product is really amazing I do this once a week I used to do it like every other day before but now um, I do it every every week so yeah, that's what I do or also sometimes for the night cream I switch to alpha edge liquid gold rejuvenating cream these creams are amazing I have got the, a separate review on this uh, line if you want to watch that video please just go and have a look i have got a full review on health alpha collection these are amazing brands so yeah that's what i do and before i go to bed i do moisturize my lips i do moisturize with my new serene aqua 4 which is not in here at the moment because it's on the bedside table um, so yeah, that's all with my skincare video. Hope you guys enjoy watching it. I will be doing a morning skincare routine video very soon. So this is the night time skincare routine that I follow. And yeah, that's all with my video. Hope you guys enjoy watching it. And thank you all for watching. See you guys soon. Bye.